Hi, uh, my name is Donna and I'm 34 years old and I have Lyme disease and I was just on the computer reading some of your stories as I have for years. I've had it for eight years. I was diagnosed three and a half years ago with it. And um, as you all know, it's uh, of all of you who have it, how evil and wicked this bug is and what it can do to you. And um, the reason I'm putting myself out there on YouTube for the world to see me looking, you know, the wreck I am is because I, I really um, respect that you guys are out there doing it and the more people that see it and the more it's out there, maybe the more people will learn about it. I recommend watching a program called Under Our Skin. Um, there's actually a blurb about it on YouTube and I have the CD and it's very educational and if I could knock on everybody's door in the entire world and make them watch it, I would. Um, I just would like, especially for any doctor, nurse, PA, anybody in the medical field right now that by any chance is watching this that doesn't know anything about Lyme, that um, you took your little oath there to help people do some homework on it, please. Because um, I've come across my fair share of doctors who don't know much about it, don't believe in it, won't treat it. I've had insurance companies not cover medicine because it was for Lyme. And anybody that's in politics, in the government, you know, in there, why don't you do your homework and realize how prevalent this is, how many people have this, how many people suffer from this, how this wrecks families, wrecks lives, and anybody that has Lyme or has had it and sees me breaking down right now on a camera for the world to see, they understand why it's extremely painful. It attacks every part of your body. I suffer every day with neurological damage and with severe joint damage. Not to mention, I mean, I could go on and on. But I'm just, I'm not here for anybody to just feel sorry for me. I don't want that. I just want people to be educated. I want, I want more pu publicity about this. I want, I mean, I've written everybody and anybody I could think of, and yet nobody wants to talk about it. And I want people to know so they don't have to go through, go through this at all. Even my friends, some of my friends and family, um, they have a very hard time understanding what this disease is and what this disease is about. Because really, if you're not with a patient that has it all the time, you won't know. Because there's days I have good days and my family just doesn't get it sometimes. They don't understand. <laughs> And I, it's, it's just hard. It's just hard, and I think the hardest part for me is watching my, watching my family watch me, having to have my mother take care of me all the time. And my two boys, I have two absolutely gorgeous boys who are 12 and 4, and my oldest boy 
misses his very active, healthy mother and is always scared I'm going to die. And my four-year-old just thinks every mommy's like this. Every mommy's sick. So, um, I guess I'm, I just want everybody to, to learn about this. Educate yourself about this. Tell your friends about this. Tell anybody you can about this. You know, because if you do get bit by a tick that carries Lyme, and you know right away, you can do the right thing and, and go to the doctors and in two weeks take some antibiotics and you'll feel better. But we need to educate people so that we can be diagnosed correctly right away rather than be diagnosed with Crohn's disease and lupus and chronic fatigue syndrome and that you're freaking crazy. Um, so I guess that's what I wanted to ask. And anybody who sees this, pass it on and like I said I really recommend you watching that under our skin it was very educational to me and I think it would do anybody good to watch it and for all of you who are watching this that have Lyme disease I'm so sorry and I pray for every one of you because I know how bad it is but there is hope, and if you are diagnosed, you will get better. It's just a long road. And someday, when I'm all better, I'll let you know. <laughs> Until then, God bless everybody. And do your best to pass it on. Thank you.